Hello Pisces, you are last but definitely not least for your mid-June, yeah, mid-June to July reading of this, ah, drop toy, current year. Congratulations, you survived once again, glad to see you. Um, someone feels like they failed, and not only failed, but threw mud on themselves and everyone else's faces in the form of a large volatile sticks just hitting everyone in the face. Like, you see all the people on the ground? They got hit with their stick. Yours is about to come back and just whack you one, too. Whoever this person is. Not you. It doesn't have to be. It could be the other person, right? So let's see what's going on with y'all. This is for Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. So if this resonates with you, good deal. If not, do not worry about it. It's just a card game after all. Alright, Pisces. Let's see what's going on with you. Everything just nearly fell out of my hand. Jesus Christ. Bad judgment call with judgment reverse. Someone's one in wish is to move with passion to whatever it is. I don't know. Fears and rejections is the seven of pentacles. Someone feels like, yes, maybe it was dumb to plant a flower in the middle of a desert and think it'll grow a forest. Maybe that was a bad idea. Uh, oh, two seconds. I gotta write this shit down. I always forget. The, um, whatchamacallit. the other one okay now sorry I have to write down the titles or else I'll forget them anyway back to your guys is my bad oh four cups is to reverse the situation total fucking loss about something what the obstacle and challenge going against you is, is possibly a Capricorn or a negative or badly influential situation. You know what? Yesterday, I just found out what an influencer was. Like, on social media or whatever. Like, influencer. It was just like... it. That's a really disturbing trend to me. I don't know why, but it's just kind of like, I don't know, like... It weirds me out that people want to influence each other all of a sudden and forget that each of us are human and make mistakes. Obstacle, uh, not obstacle, um, the beginning and the ending, what started this and what ended it, the catalyst and final result, Queen of Wands, Sagittarius, Leo, or Aries, someone demanding something from somebody. She's standing there waiting with her bitches, just being like, you're going to come over here and give me exactly what the fuck I want. You know, like, she's expecting someone to give her what she wants and they haven't. Because someone's been wasting time with the hanged man reverse. Wasting time, losing valuables in that throws as well. Fucking around, right? Right. Yeah, I was someone had a back judgment call about a Capricorn or a, or a relationship that they thought wasn't good for them. One of the two, because that's what I'm seeing here. And it's like, whatever loss or regrets they have in this is encouraging them to go to the person who is making the demands. Like, they're wanting the action now. It's like total loss, in a sense. And the bad judgment calls what's caused them to realize that this was indeed unfortunate. Okay. Ooh. Yeah, someone refused to turn around, turn around, every now and then I get a little bit lonely, da 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 da, you know, like, they refused to turn around, they were being immature about expressing their emotions, and that was a bad judgment call. Four of Cups reversed, someone has regrets over this, um... Bad judgment call, I feel like, in this situation. 
and it's because they didn't see the peace offering. They thought it was like a like they were cold, they were hungry, they were starved, they were out of their they couldn't see clearly. And this wreath was which was supposed to be a peace offering, they thought it was a fish, so they killed the bird and destroyed the wreath. And it was just like they couldn't see things for what they truly were. They didn't see this equals bringing a peace offering and kind of killed it and it was just kind of like oops my bad prince of wands someone wanting to take action leo sagittarius or aries could definitely be aries this is aries fits the impulsivity thing um because they don't know whether or not this love is still there for them like this woman's been turned to stone waiting for a person and now they're just finally showing up after all this time it's just like oh now you decide to show up huh okay like the like the like the person's heart's turned to stone, and they want to see if they can warm it back up. Ah, definitely Capricorn, Capricorn. Double energy with that Pisces. Ooh, you guys could definitely be in the devil energy. Devil's just letting shit happen. Like you know what? It's okay. You guys just go ahead and and keep arguing out. I'm just gonna sit here and watch you. See if you guys actually take the time to like understand each other. And it's like no. Like, they're both wearing each other's masks to be like, eh, I, this is what you're doing, but they're really projecting themselves onto the other person. They see the other person for the shame and affluence for what they actually carry. And the devil is just summoned here, sitting here, just listening to him, just be like, you know, I could give you guys counseling, but since you guys don't want to listen, you know, so it could be that situation. The fears and rejections up here with the seven of pentacles reverse where someone realized that planting a flower in the desert will not make a um, garden grow. Now they feel like they are being watched carefully as they try to move on to their happiness. Like someone is definitely keeping an eye on them after this sort of failure of sorts. Like this, this bad investment with the Seven of Pentacles definitely caused some people to start keeping eyes on them and it's like hindering them from being focused on what makes them actually happy. Like they feel trapped in it. Queen of Wands. Once again, Sagittarius, Leo, or Aries sitting there waiting. I won't say patiently, but definitely waiting. The longer you wait, the more fun she's going to have with your ass once you come up. Like, oh, okay. You wanted to make me wait. Like, you wanted to make me wait. Okay. That's fine. That's fine. I'll just keep waiting for you. <laughs> I'll keep waiting. Oh. She's gentle and kind and loving. And <laughs> she's definitely a mother figure. This is the empress right here. Once again, Aries, also Taurus or Libra, that Venus energy, that motherly figure, that calm, nurturing side. It's almost it, like, how strange, like, huh. Like sitting there waiting for someone to come back like they're supposed to. Only to show them kindness and love like a mother would. That's silly. <laughs> that was ridiculous. It, it, yeah, it's, it's just kind of like, you know, someone comes back from a redemption and they're redeemed. But still, she's got her posse in the back. She will fuck you up, right? The ending theme to a pentacles. Definitely looking over your options and looking forward to it. There's an ocean behind you. There's a boat sailing away. You might be a little bit too focused on your options and not realize your boat just sailed away as you're standing on the pier. And that's because you wasted too much time. Not just you, Pisces, also cross watchers and anybody else as well, of course. Three advice cards right here. Someone just doesn't want to communicate. Someone just is just ignoring directions on a box of cereal. Just being like, oh, I gotta pour the milk into the bowl after the cereal. No, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna pour the, mo the milk directly into the cereal. That's what I'm gonna do. And then I'm gonna put it in the bowl. And then I'll just save the rest for later. It'll be fine. Like, you know, it's kind of like one of those where some, like, someone's just not, someone just wasn't, like, listening. And it kind of backfired on them. And that's where this, um, 
Ace of Swords backwards comes in because it was just like they just didn't see it coming. Um, then we have the lovers right here. It's just like, you know, it's just like, okay. It's almost like the double energy with the devil is like... This person realizes that the that they were projecting themselves onto the other person and the exact same thing. And now it's like, if you guys come back together, it's going to be going into the darkness together. But being able to connect enough to understand each other as well. That you are you and they are they and you shouldn't project yourselves onto the other person. Because that's not good for either of you because that's where the miscommunication comes from. Last car, but certainly not least. Uh, someone like didn't fall asleep to this, refused to deliver this um, happy ending with the Ten of Cups right here. Like, it could have been something that was accomplished, but it's more like a dream. Someone just decided, no, I'm not doing that. I'm not offering that. You know, and maybe there was a choice in resurrecting. Something to die because this is death reverse right here. But it's on the happy side where stuff was brought back to life. But it's like after it was brought back to life, it was just... You continued on until everything was bare. It's just like there's nothing else to explore. Um, the lessons have all been learned and shit. Like, but still waiting for something that you feel like you've been wasting your time on. Yeah, yeah, it, 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 it's still, it, like, even if, like, the lack of communication leaves this relationship empty. Like, if you do get with this person, or even if you come to understand each other, it's like, you gotta kinda go into this darkness together, but you both are still gonna be learning about who you are on an individual level. And it could be that during this stage where you guys are trying to learn about each other and both vices is, and realizing that, no, it's not me who's just negative. It's both of us who are negative. We're doing this to each other. Um, it gets boring. It gets boring very quick. Like, it, it's a new beginning, sure, after the death of something. But it gets boring. Like, it was just like, you know what, I'd rather this just stay dead, because at least I would have had some thrills in my life. No, it's just straight up boring. It's boring. It's, uh, it's been lived out. You've seen this play a million fucking times. You know, it, it's just one of those things. Like, this is like my eighth time being resurrected. You know, shit like that, right? But, that is your reading, Pisces. Thank you for watching my video. Um, if you want a personal reading, my email is down in the description box below. And I don't charge. I take donations and tips. So my PayPal is down there if you so choose to do that. You may like, share, and subscribe if you would like as well. Love y'all's faces. You guys take it easy and be safe. Stay suspicious. Bye-bye.